Hi, uh, today we'll be printing from the Oki Data C331 and this tutorial is about uh, using the multi, uh, multi-purpose multi tray here which is located here at the top of the printer here or in the front I should say okay so uh, first we'll go ahead and uh, yeah, let's go ahead and open this up first All right. so that's that and we'll slide this out right over here okay and this pops out backwards this way too and uh, we're going to go to the back of the printer and open that as well. If you don't open this part back here, uh, it won't work at all. Well, I don't know, but I think it might not, but you're supposed to open this up because it'll take it straight back here when it prints. Okay, let's see here. So, we'll open that up there. There we go. Mine is really tight to the wall, but if you have more room, you can uh, slide this part out here. So your paper won't fall off, but I'm just gonna leave it down here for now since I don't have any room there. So the next step is to uh, go ahead and send this to print here. Okay, so we'll go ahead and file and print. Okay, there it goes. All right, so right here it's really important to uh, go under your printer dialog box here. I'm using Illustrator, so you're your program might be a little different here but an illustrator is also it's an old illustrator I think it's CS3 or 4 or something like that but uh, right in here you want to go to layout and you want to go to paper feed right in here you go right over here manual feed oh it's already set there so that's done for me already and you want to go ahead and hit print and once again hit print here at the bottom Okay, and that's going to send it off. There we go, and in order for this to pick up right over here, you want to go ahead and push this down right over here, and load the paper in there. There we go, and you want to press this blue button here, push it inwards, and that's going to grip it right there. And right now this screen here is saying processing. Ooh, okay, so that's processing. And we're gonna wait for them to, for the printer to let us know that it's ready. So once it's ready, we're gonna, gonna press the online button there. Okay. So it looks like it's still processing. This part takes a little long. For some reason, it takes longer to multi, uh, or for using the multi-purpose tray here than it is to uh, just print straight from the tray at the at the bottom there tray there. Okay, anyways this is still processing. Okay, once it tells us it's ready, we'll uh, press that button there. There it goes. And that's telling us here. It says letter in a multi-purpose tray. Okay, press online. So that's the online button we want to press. And uh, there it goes. Now it's going to go ahead and suck it up from there. And I'm just experimenting here with the uh, transfer paper. I'm not even sure if this is going to work. No, it's not working. I don't know how you get the idea of how to use a multi-purpose tray here by using the same technique I just showed you here. Okay. Well, thanks for watching.